Welcome to Take Action and Get Profits with Michelle Sism, where entrepreneurs come together to discuss business growth strategies, marketing ideas, techniques, and tips. Brought to you by the Tough Talk Radio Network. Now here's your host, Michelle Sism. Attention entrepreneurs, it's time to get real. Real about who you are, where you want to be, and what you're willing to do to get there. To make the leap from just getting by, to making real money and making a real difference in this world takes a plan and certain skills. If you are serious about building a business that makes a difference in this world, join Michelle Sism at her Legacy Live event in Houston, Texas, September 10th through the 12th. Learn more at LegacyLiveEvent.com. We will see you there. All right, are we back? I hope you guys can hear me. I'm not. Uh, we had a little break for part of my commercial for my event. It sounds like <laughs> it's all good though, right? Um, so anyway, I was going to tell you how you can connect with us because you know it's very important that we stay connected. This show is for you. It's all about building your business, and um, and so a couple of things that we want to talk about real quick and number one is I'm going to give you a couple of ways to be connected with us. It is first and foremost our phone number. Be sure that you, um, if you have any questions, if you want to call into the show, we would love to have you. The number is 347-989-1363, 347-989-1363. The second way that you can connect with us is on Facebook and um, you, know, you can reach out to us at facebook.com forward slash decisive minds or facebook.com forward slash tough talk radio. And then third, absolutely not least, though, would be on iTunes. So a lot of you, lots and lots and lots of you have been downloading the shows from iTunes. You can find us, find us, at Take Action, Get Profits on iTunes.com. Take Action, Get Profits on iTunes.com. So Today I am super excited because we are going to be, um, for the next, I believe, five shows, um, our guests on the shows are actually going to be the speakers from my event that's coming up in Houston. Whoops. And um, oh, that video started as well. <laughs> We're having a, one of those technology days around here, people. But that's okay. We keep on going. Uh, anyway. Our guests for the next five shows are going to be the different speakers that will be speaking at my event in September, the Legacy Live event. And so I'm, I'm super excited to introduce you guys to each of them. So we will have our first two today, and that's going to be a lot of fun. I was actually on, the, um, I was on a call the other day with a friend of mine, Jane Duber. And we were talking about marketing. You know, She does events. I do events. Um, we were talking about how do you get people – into things, not just events, but everything that we do. And you know, there's there's kind of become this whole way of marketing where we, um, you know, we we talk about different things and kind of indirectly talk about what it is that we want people to do and and where they should go. And she and I were having a conversation about the fact that um, it sure would be fun if we could just tell you exactly what we want. Right? Not beat around the bush, not uh, give you lots of different options, just exactly what we want. So that is what you're going to see from me and hear from me for the next five weeks. Because in September, on the 10th, 11th, and 12th in Houston, we're doing something extremely important. And the reason I do it is to help you grow your business. You know, I, just like you, have a limited amount of time every day. I get the same 24 hours that you do. And that means that on a one-on-one -on -one basis, I can only work with so many clients. And so you know, I, there has to be ways for me to work with many clients at one time so that I can help others more grow their businesses. And so we're doing that at the Legacy Live event, September 10th through 12th in Houston. And you can find out more about that at LegacyLiveEvent.com. 
And I wanted to just cover today why you need to be there. It doesn't matter where you live, where you're listening from. I travel to to lots of events, so it doesn't mean you have to be just from Houston. You need to be looking at what's the why should you be there? What is it that you're going to get out of this event? And so for me, it's all about the idea of building something bigger than just you. It's not about making a living anymore. It is truly about creating a legacy business, something that will is bigger than you are, something that you can at some point execute the exit strategy that you choose, right? Whether that is that you want to sell the company like I've done or whether that is that you want to transition it to the next generation or whether that is that you want to run it from – Costa Rica, whatever that looks like, some island somewhere, some beach somewhere, whatever it looks like, there has to be a plan in place. And you have certain things that you have to do. We've talked a lot about that over this last year of how do you get started. And and we've talked about you putting systems in place to get things systemized so that you can start to bring on the team and the additional help and train others to do what you do and all of those pieces. So Today, what I wanted to do in the next four minutes before we go to break officially is I wanted to take you through my, um, very quickly and very broad here, I'm not going to go deep into anything, the seven steps for building a legacy business. And this is exactly what I'm going to take you into detail over in the three days in Houston. So you need to get there if you're serious about creating a legacy in this world. Number one You have to be known for something. For a lot of you, that uh, really means that you need to choose your path, correct? You're having a hard time deciding what it is that you do. You're you're doing 10 different things, and, um, and you have to choose one. For some of you, you've been committed to it for a while, but you're not really committed to it. So when you're committed to it, you'll get known for it. So that's, um, that's number one. Number two is um, the visibility and credibility piece. And so once we are committed to something, once we have figured out exactly what it is that our company is doing at the moment, then we need to learn how to build the visibility and credibility so that um, you know, you, the business begins to grow and the systems begin to be utilized in place and, and that works. The third thing is to get to a point where your business has a consistent cash flow. So, you know, it's, it is probably one of the biggest issues I see for entrepreneurs, and that is cash flow. It doesn't matter if you're sitting there with a solo, as a solopreneur and a small business, or if you're running a trucking company like I was and doing $15 million a year. It didn't matter. Cash flow can, is, is, uh, can be an issue. And there are things that you can do, things that you can put in place to fix that. And so that's one of the things I want to work on in Houston. Number four is the actual creation of the systems and processes needed for growth. Okay, So there are certain um, systems and processes that you need to get down. They need to be created. They need to be written down. They need to be in a format that can be passed on to someone else, and then they can do them. Number five is learning how to leverage your business. Now, a lot of people, you notice this is number five. A lot of people want this to be number one, right? And the fact is there there are things you have to get done before you can leverage your business. Um, you have to get a steady, consistent cash flow. You have to get a steady, consistent flow of clients. You have to truly stand for something. You can't have a leveraged business until you do those things. Number six is what I call the free me plan. So as we're moving through this process of uh, creating a business that's a legacy business, a lot of people start out saying, well, I want to have this business where I don't have to do much work. Everybody else does all the work. Well, let's get a little reality here, people. It's not how it works. In the beginning, it is us. We're building the business. We hold the dream. You know, the the dream wasn't given to someone else. It was given to us. And so um, there comes a point in time, however, when you get to the point where you can actually execute what I call the free me plan. You know, in Decisive Minds, we have the free Michelle plan. And that is to take more of what it is that I do and move it over to team members or more of what I do and move it over to coaches and and have me become uh, more the uh, executive strategy person, still 
implementing some of the coaching with my clients, but uh, taking me out of the day-to-day work. And then number seven is the uh, what I call the stabilization and then the exit plan, which means that you've got the company in a place where it's stable, it's profitable, it can run without you, right? And you get to the point where you can choose if you want to, to execute on the exit plan. You may not make the choice. You may love it the way it is, and you continue to work on that. So this is what we're going to do for three days in Houston. I'm going to take you through each one of those steps. I'm going to tell you exactly what you have to do in each piece to get to the next piece. Also, the other thing you should know is that this is not um, get it over with and done quick, right? If you're serious about building a legacy business, then this is a five- to seven-year plan. And if you don't get started, it's still a five to seven year plan. So if you come to me in two years, it's still five to seven years, right? So why not join me in September and get started? So you can go to LegacyLiveEvent.com, and we are going to take a short break. And when we get back, we will speak with our first guest. Live a choice where your imagination becomes your reality. If you can imagine it, it's possible. If you can believe it, it's yours. We get it. You're done with the way it is now. You're finished with all the frustration around why you feel stuck and your life isn't working. Imagine what your life would be like if you could have all the answers and see new possibilities. We at Live It Choice choose to make a difference. Live It Choice has developed a proven process and a series of questions that lead participants to the answers they seek, gaining new understanding and self-awareness for both your personal and professional life. If you're ready to get to the life you want, contact us today. Visit liveatchoice.com to get started. Did you know that an estimated 52 million Americans listened to internet radio in the last month? Or that weekly internet radio audience has increased 60% over the last year, and that more than 8 in 10 people are online from any location. Tough Talk Radio Network is a company dedicated to providing a platform that allows opportunities for guests, hosts, and sponsors to market themselves to the internet radio media where they can be heard by millions. To find out how Tough Talk Radio Network can help you, go to toughtalkradionetwork.com. Attention entrepreneurs, it's time to get real. Real about who you are, where you want to be, and what you're willing to do to get there. To make the leap from just getting by, to making real money and making a real difference in this world takes a plan and certain skills. If you are serious about building a business that makes a difference in this world, join Michelle Sism at her Legacy Live event in Houston, Texas, September 10th through the 12th. Learn more at LegacyLiveEvent.com. We will see you there. Yay, and we are back with our first guest for the show, Matthew Goldfarb. Are you there? I'm here. How are you? I I am very good and very excited that you're on the show today. Me too. <laughs> so this is this is like super special. So you're no, number one, you're the first one of my speakers from the event to be on the show. We're doing this special month of August. Uh, guest speakers from my event, so that's the first thing. And number two, you and I have a super special relationship here. So, <laughs> you know, I, I could do your official bio, but I'm just going to tell people what I know about you, and then I'll let you fill in all the blanks. How about that? Sounds great. Okay, cool. So, guys, this is Matthew Goldfarb, and Matthew and I are um, – We've been kind of running in the same circles for about four years now. He is, uh, let's call him a copywriter extraordinaire. And um, But this is what's funny. And so I was actually telling somebody this story the other day, Matthew. Matthew and I are both extreme introverts and very shy. And so we played the can I talk to you without meeting you kind of thing for a while. <laughs> so the first event we were together, I think we kind of just kind of like saw each other in the hall, and it's like, hey, kind of thing. And in the next event, Matthew came over to my booth and left his book. I wasn't there. He left his book, (laughs) and I was like, okay, this is cool. I really need to talk to this guy. And it was like the next year, (laughs) right? And so this is how our relationship started. But then we made the smartest – I probably made the smartest move I have ever made, and that was to hire you to work on my messaging. 
for my company this year. And we started that process back in January. And, um, man, it has been good. It has been really good. So I, if, if I didn't read anything in your 